Hey, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to more Blasphemous. All right, it's been a few days since I've played. I have some notes. So I don't remember what to do. <laughs> Let's get going. Oh, I've played this for four and a half hours. Hmm. Okay, so. Oh, that's right. Um, this area has some toxins in the air that we need a bead for, which we can get from here. Um, also, there was a door that I couldn't open. Mm -hmm. Let me, let me see, let me see, let me see. There was a door that I couldn't open, but there were blood stains at the bottom. Oh! Hi. Forgot about you. Oops. Stop. <laughs> oh, I tried to phase through him. Oh no, oh no, this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay. Oh, there we go. That's what I was trying to do. That's better. That's right. As I was saying, before I was rudely interrupted. Wait, is this where it was? Oh, dang. Okay, now I'm confused. Oh, maybe I have to take the ladder down? Oh no, is it in here? <gasps> yes, it's in here. Hmm. Oh! Okay, I don't know what I did there. Did I use, I used my blood for something, right? There was a, okay, anyway. Um, I got an item. Heart of the Unnamed Minstrel. Sword core forged amidst ballads of forbidden verses can be inserted into Mia Culpa. Reduces the duration of the parry, but eases the execution of the righteous repost. Sing for me, Cantor, and may your song relieve my pain. Those were the words written on the tombstone. There lay the one who prayed by singing, creature of verses that one fateful day reached the wrong hearts. And even if we no longer hear his voice and no, no one calls his name, his singing will remain with us forever. Huh. Interesting. So the one we have right now boosts the blocking stance, increases his duration, but exposes us longer to enemy attacks. Reduces the duration of the parry, but eases the execution of a righteous repost. What is what is a righteous repost? Okay. Um, back to our plan. So nice. Um, we can need to get the moss preserved in glass, which I think we have enough money for. And then uh we need to go to Mercy Dreams, but I don't remember why. Where is Mercy Dreams? I mean, it must be for moss preserved in glass, right? Maybe I was saying that, maybe I wrote that down because we need to explore this area. Okay. Also, there's a hidden floor somewhere here. Okay. Let's, let's, uh, let's get going. Let's go downward. Let's go to Albero first. Hi, I hope everyone's doing okay. I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. Um, can we do it? Go down again. How do we call that one? I don't know. Oh, we call this like this. Ah, that's nice. I was wondering the first time we got the elevator, I was like, why? We're already at the elevator. Why would it, why would it have a lever for us to take it away? Okay. Um, now I don't know where this hidden floor is, but let's take a look. Maybe it's down here. Hmm. 
Mm, wait. <gasps> oh, a hidden door. I can't even read my own notes. Calcinium of Persian, the bandit. Cal Calcanium? Feared by his countrymen, Persian attacked roots with Persian attacked roots without distinction between rich or poor and always alone. The day he dragged himself to a burrow on the brink of death, no one took pity on him. Mm. Makes sense. What's in here? Oh. Oh. Hello? What's this? What is this? This lowly servant greets you, O oh penitent one. Oh, are you okay? Welcome to the ossuary of all those who will be eternally remembered. Hmm. My duty is none other than to provide shelter to each and every one of these skeletal remains that linger under these intangible veils of dust. It matters little how many years or centuries have passed. The bones speak to us through their creaking and grinding and through their silence. But these remains need one another in order to reveal the truth they still guard within. Only together, in intimate brotherhood, will they achieve eternal rest. For this, they beg that you help them. Hmm. Bring them before me, and in this way, we will uncover the truth that they have silenced. Are you referring to the collectibles that I've been collecting? Was there a thing? Um, um, right? Oh, yeah! The bones thank you for your help, O oh virtuous penitent one. Bring the bones before me, and we will uncover the truth that they keep silent. Nice. Are those, is that sand? It kind of sounds like sand. That's cool. Okay, um, what's over here though? Ooh, desecrated cistern. Um, I don't know. Should we? Oh, I don't know. Why not? Oops, 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 oops. No. Okay. What's in here? <gasps> Whoa! Are those statues? Uh, is this a boss battle? Two faces greet you, penitent one. My name is Nasimianto. Oh, his feet. Look at my chest, upon which I don't want to look at it. Grows older and older. A face. He's just like, look at it. That does not think, while mine becomes younger. Such that I now look like a child. Oh, weird. Such a terrible sentence is this that I do not understand its purpose. No matter how much I reflect on the sin that I may have committed to deserve it. Okay, why are there giants in this? The grace of the miracle is present even in those who are punished. Perhaps I might reduce the magnitude of this sentence by helping you. Oh. Bring me the quicksilver, which is capable of flourishing under our feet in any place at the whim of the grievous one the and grievous one the bile from your flasks thereby enhancing its gift i don't have quicksilver yeah you need a thousand atonement and uh, i have the bile flask mm. bring me the quicksilver okay there's nothing behind you Okay, weird. Okay, those faces are weird. Okay, at least it that marked it for me. Okay. Maybe I'll do this too. Oops. 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 <laughs> there we go. That'll show that there's there's something to be done there. Was there anything here? Oh, I can go down. Okay. Oh, there's a little leaky leak. 
Nope. Oh, yeah. <gasps> oh, oh gosh. Please. Maybe we should just go get them. The... Oh, wait, where are the mountains of the endless dusk? Okay. Nope, no. I gotta go get that thing. <laughs> also, it'd be nice to get to a Mia Culpa. I don't remember where the closest one is. Hmm, is it this one? It's gotta be. Oh, that's a fast little droplet. Right? I think it's this way. Oh yeah, because we were right here. Okay. Oh wait. I think I equipped those here at a pre -DU. I think that one's the closest pre -DU. Ah, there we go. Okay, let's try equipping this. We'll use this for a little while and see how that, how that, how that goes. <laughs> um, all right, all the way to the right. <laughs> nice. Oh, so cool. That was so good. Good job. Got you. No. Ah. Ah. Ah, he still got me. <laughs> oh well. Am I going the right way? I feel like I'm okay. I feel like I'm instantly going the wrong way. Um faster to go the yeah, I think I have to go this way actually. Hmm. I wonder what the difference between like a red door and a blue door is. No. <laughs> um. Yeah. And this one's a green door. I mean, like the light coming from it. You know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about? Uh. All the way down. Mm-hmm. Oh. I don't like just dropping. It's a little scary. This way? Oh god. Oh my god, dude. Y'all need to frickin' chill out. Nope. Yep. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Hey, lady. Hey, I'm back. <laughs> oh, this is the only one I didn't get. <laughs> I'll buy it. Okay. It's not too bad. In terms of money. Um, I'll have to take off one of these. This one creates fervor when destroying surrounding objects. Covers health, health when destroying. Uh, I'll take this off. Because I think that getting health back when I'm hitting nearby items is actually pretty beneficial. Okay. There's something else in Mercy Dreams that I wrote down. But I don't know what else. Let's just um, get this preview first. And then we'll explore down there. <laughs> nice. It's funny how the muscle memory for this, uh, the controls of this game kind of like come right back. I guess not just this game either. Like, a lot of games, if you play a lot of it, you know, after a while, <laughs> the, mus the muscle memory just uh, um, kicks in. Have we explored that way? Yeah. Okay. There must be a reason why... Oops. 
Oh. There we go. There has to be a reason why I didn't explore this area to begin with. Oh, was I too scared of that? Oh, what's with that shaky cam? Nice. Gotty. Oh. Oh gosh. <laughs> No, don't hit me with your ugly whips. Oh god, it's that guy. Ugh. What a dweeb. Oh, I was trying to charge up. That's more like it. Oh god. Oh, I was trying to do a special attack finishing move, but it didn't work. Phew! No. <laughs> there we go. Oh god. Oh, perfect. That didn't hurt. That doesn't hurt me when I'm doing special attack. Just good. Ah. God, get closer. Don't be a little bitch about it. Oh. Oh. Yeah. No! Perfect. Um, just gotta quickly run away, you know? <laughs> Come on over. Idiot. What? That didn't kill you? Stupid. Siri's not so bad. here. Uh, I could have sworn that was going to be a door. No! Ah, uh, I was trying to do it first. Nice. Got him! That guy's face looked pretty ugly. Oh no, that's totally a trap. Nope. 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 Oh gosh, oh gosh. <laughs> nice, nice. <laughs> it just tosses it aside. Okay, this is, yeah, this area is totally a trap. Let's just heal up. I freaking knew it. Ah, God. No, stop. Get both of them at the same time. Nice. Get some extra points in there. Stop! What an asshole. Oh my god, it's so annoying. There we go. Now. We get the item. Empty bile vessel. Okay. A vessel made of crystal and gold, capable of holding the hallowed bile that emanates from the morning fountains. Get up and tell us what you witness, said the scribe without averting his gaze from the paper. I received an order for the exhumation of a penitent who had been buried about a year ago, answered the gravedigger. He was well loved in Albero, and many parishioners approached his grave. But when I dug him up, we saw blood coming from a crack in his sarcophagus, blood red as wine. Those who were there rushed to open the lid of the coffin and carried him on their shoulders, watching as blood gushed out from its side. Others ran to their houses, searching for buckets and bottles to keep all that blood that wouldn't stop flowing out. That's creepy. 
That's very suspicious. I wouldn't collect it. <laughs> um, okay. I wonder... There's, there's gotta be a way to get on that other side. Oh, we didn't go this way yet, that's why. Oh, this has gotta be a door. Oh, I guess not. <laughs> Never mind. It was just trying to trap me. All right, uh, yeah, you know. Oh, it's her. Hi. In place of blessings have I been entrusted with watching over you, penitent one. Thus it has been arranged. My name is Viridiana. I have been granted a gift with which I can assist you in carrying your burden if required. But only you can make that choice. Penitent one in silence. Will you require my assistance with your next task? I'm going to say no. Lest you change your mind. Um, I don't know if she's like a one-time like companion. The reason why I said, oh, it's her was because in the other playthrough when I was like practicing, um, I ran into her. And I was surprised that that we could have companions. Hi. Wow, those are some strong hits. Um, let's go this way. Let's see what's over here. Oh. Whoa, where does that go? Oh, we could travel to Albero. Oh. Oh, that's the um, the locked door from the other side. Bouquet of thyme. Isn't that the ingredient he was looking for? Bunch of aromatic herbs common in the past amidst the cliffs of the bronze borders. Today, however, their scarcity makes them increasingly valuable, especially for those who discern their healing abilities. It wasn't long before more and more people came to us, affected by that terrible and unknown suffering. Whole families, the old, the young, and even the newborn. We brothers of the congregation were unable to cope, and our care was not working. Nor were our ointments, nor our constant prayers. We are lost, submerged in the darkness of uncertainty. Okay. Nice. Let's talk to the, this guy real quick. I think this is the ingredient he, he needed, right? Because he even said it talks about like being an ointment. Hey. Oh, just the incense garlic? Okay. Merciful be, penitent one. With your contribution, the work of this brotherhood carries on. Mm. Mm. We have I have linen cloth. Okay. A useless rag that seems to slightly vibrate at times, emitting an unintelligible buzz. The affliction sometimes leaves its mark on mundane-looking objects, unable to reveal the miracle under its mantle of corruption. Febrile, febrile as he was, he hardly noticed that someone had sat down next to him. A gentle hand patted a white cloth on his forehead. It was a, a fabric of the utmost softness, which allowed light through it as if it were a sheet of paper, and was soaking his feverish sweats and providing such relief that he could not help but fall asleep. When the cloth was soaked, the nun got up and handed it to the mother superior, adding, With this, we will be able to have his confession. Whoa, that's really cool. There's nothing else? Oh, okay. Perfect. I thought it was this. Yeah, it makes sense. Merciful be penitent. Yeah, you're welcome. Tears of Atonement. Cool. Anything else that we have? No, I guess not. Okay, let's go back this way. And keep exploring Mercy Dreams. <laughs> cool. Yeah, I don't know if that companion is a one-time thing. I feel like I'd want to... If it is a If she is a one-time thing, I'd want to wait until... I'm working on something that I know is hard. But she could also be... A part of a quest, you know? Got him. Got you first! 
idiot. Those guys aren't too bad. I wonder if there's like a... If the floor opens up. Ugh. Now that I know the floor opens up... Oh god. Ugh. I tried. <laughs> okay. Ugh. Ugh. I tried really hard. <laughs> Didn't work. Pisiform of Hernandez, the explorer. Victor Hernandez was chosen to lead an expedition meant to civilize barbaric tribes. He was sentenced for heresy when he suggested that Custodia was the most uncivilized of all known places. That's awesome. Is that it? That's all you're gonna give me? Just go. Just go. Ah, uh, what? Okay, I get it. Uh, I guess I should have just... Oh, well. I'll, I'll use the pre-do when I get up here. Ugh, there's gotta be... I can't tell. There's gotta be a floor. A breakable floor right there. Okay. Do that. And then... Let's explore this area. Ooh. What's over here? <gasps> oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. Oh my god. Oh no. What? Oh god. <laughs> Why can't I go through him? Oh my god, I can't go through him. Okay. Uh, I think I can do this. No, I can't go through him. Oh, I, I have to wait until he lifts his foot. Ah, oh, jeez. Fuck, I'm totally dying. Oh, wow. Okay, how do I... I still don't know how to use my thing. Dude. Okay. <sighs> nice. Yeah, how do I use my little power up? Do I have to wait? Oh, yep. Yeah, I'm totally dying. Oh no. Oh no, I'm dead. It's okay. <laughs> that first one's always just learning about the boss, right? <laughs> learning about the enemy. It's okay. I feel like that guy isn't too hard to beat, though. Like, I think I can do it. I just have to... figure out his moves a little better. I also still don't know how to use my thing. Gosh, what is your deal, man? And you're you're so ugly. Ugh. Ugh. Oh my god. Okay. Oh gosh. Ugh. Oh, and that's poisonous. I don't like that. Oh, I tried to jump, but I jumped too late. Ah! What are you doing there? Oh, I can jump over him right there. Go, 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 go. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh gosh. No. Don't get mad. Get glad. my last flask already. Ah! Are you kidding me? I was using a flask. Oh my god. I forget about that. Yeah. No, not two of them. 
I tried to jump. Oh no, no. I always forget about those little thingies that come out of the ground. That's okay, that's okay. Second death, no problem, no problem. That's my average, it's less than my average right now actually. It's fine. <laughs> this one, yeah. I don't know how to use this one. It generates a barrier of divine lightning that damage any enemies trying to cross it. Mm. Yeah, let's equip that one. Let's start using that one again. Because I know at least that one's reliable. <laughs> Okay, we can do this. Oh, I dashed really close to him. That way we can do some ranged attack on him. Oh my god! Like that. There we go. That's much better. Oops. Nope. Forgot about that. Don't. Just step on your own thing. Ooh, so close. Oh, that was really close too. Ooh, ah! No. Oh, that was really close. Just barely. <laughs> Come on. Ah! Don't get me with that ugly thing. Oh my gosh, I just get really, um, greedy with that fourth hit. Oh no. Oh no. I could do that too. Except mine is better. Oh gosh! <gasps> that wasn't fair. Oh god, okay. Ooh, this one's this one's gonna be a close one. Don't 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 hit me. Don't hit me with a fourth one. <gasps> mm. Mm. Oh dang, it was the third one. Of course. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm getting greedy, <laughs> and I need to be more careful. His big belly <laughs> just hanging. Ooh, ooh, no. <sighs> God, it's ugly little vines. I knew that other one was gonna get me. I also knew I was, if I was gonna stay, then he'd hit me. Oh god. Oh! Dude. Okay. Lost all my flasks. We can do it. 
Oh shit! Go. Oh my god, I just ran right into that one. Okay. No, oh my god! Oh. Run. So nerve wracking. <gasps> yes, no mercy. <sighs> okay. <laughs> cool. Oh, that was so stressful. Whoa, it just fades away. Please don't let me die. Ooh. Oh, whoa, that looks so cool. What's happening? Oh, <gasps> what? What? Where am I? I have way too low health to be doing this. <laughs> whoa. Okay, there's some sort of cataclysmic... Oh, oh, oh. Hello? In the name of the great ordeal and the sons of the miracle, when you humbled yourself before my most holy body, you have been granted the presence of my golden visage, custodian of one of the three sorrows of the soul in penance. Okay. When you humble yourself before my most holy body, even greater the presence of okay. I'm just too stunned. I'm like not listening. <laughs> okay. Okay. Mm. Holy wound of attrition. Interesting. Okay. What was it? Oh. Mark left by the golden visage that reveals the cleanliness of attrition in the soul of the penitent one. Sento Credo verse 1. His holiness, because of his high penance, must endure suffering in his soul in three ways. Each of the ways is a motive, and each motive is a sore. Hence, these three sores are the keys to his eternal pain and must be guarded. Interesting. Oh, hey! Uh, what's his name? Dio Gracias? You have carried out <gasps> the first humiliation of penance. What?! Have met the visage of attrition. You have yet to prostrate before two last holy visages. Okay. <gasps> what? That's so awesome. Wow, okay, I think I'm gonna end the video here then. What a productive episode. I didn't even I didn't even mean to do that. Also that boss didn't seem too hard, right? <laughs> Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Let me know if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more content. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks. Bye, guys. Bye.